Howdy folks, how's it going? Not a bad view, that is Taos, New Mexico. I'm here at the house where I'm house sitting, where I've been the past uh, week or 10 days or something like that. Um, definitely a little change of scene for me from my travels and staying in tiny little, you know, budget uh, hotel rooms and, and uh, hostels and everything. Uh, so as you can see, this is a really nice uh, place. And I have it to myself. The uh, woman that owns the house has another house elsewhere, and, and uh, she's gone for the month, so um, I have the option of staying here uh, through the month of May. So I'm not sure if I'm going to stay the whole time or not. Just kind of, you know, taking it day by day and, and uh, enjoying the break from the travels. So it's a two bedroom. Got a master bedroom in the back there. Bathroom. Nice little kitchen, washer and dryer, and then another uh, guest room here. Uh, <clears throat> so I'm just kind of figuring out my plans like for the summer, uh, trying to figure out what I'm going to be doing. Um, I have no idea, but I have lots of ideas uh, to, to consider. So uh, I'm just uh, you know, enjoying this chance to kind of pause the intense traveling and everything, catch up on videos, working on uh, various video projects, um, and uh, just kind of thinking about the future. So um, I thought that I would show in this video what my diet is, because uh, a few people have asked in the past, um, just thought, you know, some people might be curious. Uh, I am uh, carnivorous, I'm a meat eater. Um, I was vegetarian for three years uh, in my 20s, um, and I definitely love good uh, organic, vegetarian, vegan food, as you will see in a second. I am uh, just very flexible in the uh, um, food department, especially as a traveler. You're um, in foreign countries, many of which uh, you know, don't have much of a selection in the vegetarian department. Um, you know, personally, I don't really want to just live on salads and stir-fry. I was just in Mexico and Guatemala. Um, tacos and enchiladas and stuff come with a choice of, you know, which meat do you want with it. So anyways, I am a meat eater, but I definitely, uh, you know, shoot for being healthy as well. So here we go. I will just open up some cupboards and everything. This is a jar of peanut butter that I bought, like... I don't even remember, Belize or Guatemala or something. It's like at least six weeks old and I've only gotten halfway through it. Anyways, all right, some, some cookies, some Triscuit crackers, uh, chickpea, um, spicy chickpea, something or other. Got some veggie chili here from Amy's. Got some, uh, here's a Santa Fe style chicken soup from Pacific Foods is really good. And then a roasted garlic mushroom lentil soup. Uh, Avocados, I'm a big avocado fan. Check out the fridge here. All right, brown cow yogurt um, is just totally delicious stuff. Uh, more avocado, mushrooms and stuff for making omelets. I'm big into omelets for breakfast um, or cereal. Raisin brand is, brand is a good one. Uh, got some, you know, Orville Redenbacher's uh, popcorn here. I prefer to go for the healthy um, option. Uh, you know, here we got some good, uh, you know, whole grain type of bread, some rye bread, some of the stuff here. Um, then I got, you know, what was available because I went to a store that was nearby here and it didn't have any health food options. So, for example, here I got some Progresso um, creamy Alfredo penne stuff with chicken and then another Progresso and like a Hormel chili because they didn't have the veggie chili uh, option and uh, I am a opportunitarian of sorts. Um, and then another Amy's chili. Got uh, kombucha, I love kombucha. Um, Adwala green juice, daily greens. Um, I also enjoy beer and wine. Got some wine here. Um, finished off this uh, a bottle of limoncello that I was invited to drink that was here in the freezer and it was quite uh, tasty stuff. Um, so, there you go. Uh, nothing in the freezer while well, I had a couple of these Indian, um, like frozen dinners. So this is a paneer tikka, so this one's vegetarian. And then a chicken tikka masala. 
Um, I love Indian food. If I was uh, living in India, which of course I've traveled in India a lot, for anyone who has followed my travels at all knows that, uh, then I could pretty much be vegetarian in India. Um, or if I was settled somewhere where I had uh, you know, access to a health food store um, and a little more you know, time and energy to devote to um, cooking, I could definitely consider um, going vegetarian. Vegan, um, in like a best case scenario of I'm living on some farm of vegans who are all amazing cooks, um, you know, yeah, I, I, I could totally uh, go for that. But I love cheese, um, I love yogurt, ice cream, uh, and uh, so it would be a little bit of a, um, a stretch. But I'm, I'm open to the possibilities and I absolutely believe that our diets are very, very important and that we should strive towards uh, as much um, health and consciousness. Um, choose organic uh, when you can. I'm just, I'm not a fundamentalist in my perspectives uh, in general. Um, and, uh, you know, I, I kind of am flexible based on my life situation and circumstances and stuff like that. So there you go. Thanks for watching. And uh, we'll see uh, what the future brings for me. I will most likely be doing some travels this summer I'm uh, thinking about doing some sort of a walking expedition like uh, the Pacific Crest Trail in California, or California, Oregon, Washington, um, the Camino de Santiago pilgrimage route in Spain, uh, the Lycian Way trek in Turkey, something like that. I'm up for just like a good, good walk and, you know, uh, just kind of an inner experience walking um, and, uh, you know, getting a taste of the travels, but without the crazy bus rides and, and uh, you know, stuff like that. Get a break from, from the internet and the computer um, for, you know, at least days or weeks at a time uh, just to kind of get, get clear a bit more and, and to healthy physically and mentally and all that kind of stuff. So um, we'll see what happens. All right. Thanks for watching. Take it easy.